Hello everybody again from Simply Foodia YouTube channel. Today we'll continue the principle number seven in our HASA plan, the record keeping and documentation. What are the elements of the record keeping and the documentation related, related to, other, to our HASA plan? First of all, the audit records. In these audit records, we must mention uh, the audit checklist and the audit reports, the external audit reports, the internal audits, and the supplier audits. So in this part, for the first record, we must ensure that we are keeping these records and documenting it are the audit records. I will explain in the upcoming videos uh, the all the records related to this has a plan. Second thing, the corrective action and non-conformance records. We have much. We must. <clears throat> sorry, we must document or our corrective action full up logs. The corrective action log itself, the non-conformance and corrective action plans, the non-conformance reports. All these reports are related to the corrective action and non-conformance records. The third documents we must. Uh, ensure that we are keeping these documents, the training and the competency records, either the training certificates, the training records, the competency checklist. So all the things related to the training must be also documented in our documentary uh, system or the, on our document system. Uh, the fourth uh, documentation we must uh, ensure about it are the maintenance and the calibration records. So we must mention the equipment maintenance logs, the preventive maintenance schedules, the calibration logs, and the instruments verification reports, or the the equipment, sorry, the equipment verification reports. So these are the fourth type of the documents we must ensure in our HASA plan. The fifth record are the sanitation and pest control records which is very important to your food safety plan and the HASA plan so we will mention the sanitation records the cleaning schedules the pest control logs each one of these have many elements and we'll explain it later and don't worry about that okay the sixth part are the product and the process monitoring records either the ccp monitoring the ph level logs if there is any pH level you are doing in your HACCP plan, the pasteurization time and the temperature log, the microbiological test result either in the lab or any external lab, the product sampling records you are collecting from the production lines. So these are the most important six uh, uh, records we must ensure in our HACCP plan. Still, we have the supplier and the ingredient management and the ingredient management records. So we must have the supplier evaluation forms, the supplier approval form, the ingredient traceability records. So uh, these are the parts related to the supplier. The eighth uh, part are the documentation and records management itself. So we must have the document update registers, any document and its update registers, the version control logs, which version we are uh, having in our HACCP plan, the food safety management system, system uh, documentation so these are all the important records you must have in your record keeping and documentation principle number seven in the upcoming videos i will explain each one of these uh, uh, records in your has plan and how you can mention in your complete has plan best of luck of all of you and goodbye